Well, good morning from rainy and beautiful Silverton, Colorado. We just got this awesome campsite last night by this rushing stream. And if you haven't noticed already, we bought an Opus 15 camper. And that's what we're up here with this weekend. We're still learning the ins and outs of it. We've got a couple of nights under our belt now, and uh, there's a lot to learn with this thing. But man, we're so grateful to have things like running water and heat inside and a full kitchen, you know, stuff that I'm not accustomed to off-grid like this. So it's been awesome, especially with the kiddos with us and a rainy day like this, they're inside watching TV right now. And uh, it's just really, really cool. So we're gonna show you guys a full tour of this thing at some point, we're excited to do that. But for now, we just wanna invite you along on its maiden voyage and uh, share with you guys a little bit of our adventure this weekend up here in the San Juans. What's up everybody? Uh, my fam and I are here in the San Juans doing some adventuring and uh, we're so stoked to have brought along our new Opus 15 camper uh, that we just purchased a few weeks ago. This is the maiden voyage and uh, you know we've got a lot of plans for this thing and excited to share some content on it with you guys. But for now, we just wanna invite you along and uh, share a little bit in this first adventure with us and see you know a little bit of what life is like with this thing behind the scenes. Right off the bat, what's super cool is this specific campsite we're at, we wouldn't be able to get to if it weren't for the suspension, the clearance, the uh, articulating hitch that this thing has. to get up right close to the river which is awesome and uh, enjoy the views and the time out here in the woods and the mountains with our kids um, it's also super easy to set up this is a modular camper which is really cool so when you're towing um, on road and then in tight trails you know it's more compact when you get to camp and it pops open the back extends out all that good stuff and it's really easy to do even with one person as you are seeing here um, it's pretty quick and simple to set up, probably about four or five minutes to get it set up with just one person.
that you? Do you want to tell everybody about the pivoting hitch that allows us to go in pretty cool places with the camper? Pretty cool places with the camper poo-poo. Oh my, that's what we just did. We emptied our poo-poo. Yep, that's the not so fun part, but now we're ready to go exploring some more, huh? It's relatively straightforward. There's a gray tank, there's a black tank, and then there's two freshwater tanks um, to yeah. empty and fill. Um, yeah. So this is a great spot to stop if you're in the area. They do a flat fee for emptying and filling and uh, very reasonable, really nice folks here at Silverton Lakes. What are you trying there, pumpkin? <laughs> Woo! <laughs> is that root beer? <laughs> okay, take a sip. It's pretty, like, bubbly, so... Take I like it! Your first root beer. Try it, buddy. Make a funny face after. Let's get the full reaction. <laughs> Whoa! We both make funny faces. Do you like it or you do not like it? I like it a lot. Another kind of unique thing to this camper is that the kitchen is fully outside. So the fridge, uh, the stove, the little galley, you know, the sink and all that running water, there's hot running water out there. It's all slide outs on the side of the camper. So inside saves room for, you know, the different uh, sleeping quarters. We got a full, like even larger than a king size mattress for my wife and I, and then two bunks for the kids, you know, table, uh, sofa, seating area and storage for clothes and gear. Um, so yeah, it's kind of a cool, you know, in and out design. Well, hopefully you enjoyed today's video. We're excited to share more about this camper in the future with you guys, as well as a trail video from this Colorado trip we've got coming up and some more Jeep content. It's been a while since I've featured the Jeep on the channel and we've got a Jeep related announcement that I'm super pumped to make here soon. So make sure you're subscribed, stay tuned for more action and I'll see you guys soon in the next video.